All right, guys, what's going on? Jamie here wanted to do a, another update video for you guys. We're going to take a look at these miners contracts, which ones are holding steady, which ones are decreasing, uh, which ones are, you know, basically doing well. And then uh, we'll cover a project that is coming that's actually launching later this week, came into, my, came into my radar a couple of days ago, but I was traveling. So I'm going to introduce it here towards the end of this video, and then I'll do a full review of it probably um, as we get closer to the launch, but wanted to put it on your radar. And then we'll talk a little bit about drip, what's going on over there. So we'll do a little bit of everything in this video. And again, I want to do it pretty quickly. So I'm going to talk, I'm going to be talking pretty fast. So uh, yeah, let's just jump right into it. Of course, everything I talk about on my channels for entertainment purposes only, definitely not giving you financial advice, guys. So again, do your own research, do your own due diligence if you're okay with risk. And let's be clear, this is all risky. Um, then and only then should you put in risk capital okay guys funds you can afford to lose um, also follow me on telegram i will leave a link for that down below and again if you haven't subscribed yet to this channel hit subscribe hit the little bell icon so you'll get notified straight away whenever i do a brand new video so it's been a couple of days <clears throat> i was actually traveling a little bit i did a 60 second video uh, while i was on the road to introduce to you the uh, usdt miner with the uh, self-sustaining or auto compounding feature. So we'll take a quick look at that. Uh, but yeah, so, you know, wanted to come in and give you a couple of these updates because there are a couple of things that are going on. So that being said, we won't look at the market today. Uh, we'll do that on another video. A couple of you guys have asked me if BNB business is still paying. Yes, it's still paying. It's not paying as much as these miners or drip or some of these other things, but it is still paying guys. So for you guys that are in this and have been asking for an update, uh, yeah, this thing is paying. You can see here there's 22,000 contributors plus. Um, con contributions have reached over 12,620 BNB. And uh, yeah, this thing still is working. I'm basically withdrawing every time I have BNB in my balance. Um, the other platform people have asked me about is Taurus Protocol. Um, they've asked if the, uh, if the uh, withdrawals are still working. And yes, everything is working. I just did a withdrawal early, earlier today. Uh, to test it out but this thing still is working perfectly fine um the price of wire token has come down a little bit but that's you know that's pretty pretty natural so we'll see what happens but that being said the platform is working you know perfectly fine uh drip you can see here the price of drip right now 17 dollars and 78 cents um I haven't really been doing much with my account as you can see i've just kind of been letting it sit went in here Took a quick look and I was like, man, there's almost $125,000 here. My available balance. I took a look at my other account. There's you know over 10,000 in there. So again, I wanna kind of get a, a read on what's happening with the Manor Farm, because again, depending on the price of drip, if it goes up, if it goes down, if it stays steady, then I'll kind of make some moves at that point. Um, maybe I'll withdraw this and probably do something with it. But yeah, I'm kind of just waiting to see what happens here with the, uh, with the, uh, the, the farm and the miner, because this is what I'm pretty excited about, uh, the drip BUSD miner. You know, the beautiful thing about these miners is, you know, you ride them on the way up, and they're paying 3%, 5%, 10%, 12%, whatever it is. And then when the contract kind of levels off, which inevitably it does, and starts to go backwards, it doesn't drop like a, like a falling rock. And you can still interact with the contract and withdraw. And then there's some gamification to, to them because, you know, people are buying into them when the contract is going down because the miners are very, very cheap at that point. But yeah, this is what I'm excited about. So you know, when this thing launches, um, you know, I'm definitely going to be going heavy into this. I'm going to be putting a bunch of BUSD. Um, am I going to get into the farm? Yeah, I'll get, I'll get into the farm. You know what I mean? I'll definitely uh, be going into that stuff. But this right here is, you know, where I'm probably going to be going the heaviest in. Um, but anyway, we'll talk about that as we get closer to it. Still have plenty of time. Um, this is kind of what I keep an eye on here. Um, I have about $10,000 that I can withdraw from these different miners. But we'll go over each one of them here because we want to show you the contracts and if they're going up, if they're you know, kind of holding steady, if they're, if they're uh, decreasing a little bit. Um, so yeah, we'll just jump into them in no particular order. This is the last one I did a video on, so I figured I'd start with this one. This is the USDT miner. 5% a day, 1,825% APR. Um, this one here, there's, uh, what is it? 25,600 USDT. So it's holding steady. Um, it's not really dropping. 
And again, I think the beauty of this is when you have this self-sustaining feature, this 25% auto compounding when people withdraw, it does, you know, at least on paper, you know, uh, you know, it should keep the contract going for quite a while. Okay. Now, again, we're experiencing this real time. You know, this is the first time we've seen these miners and a lot of us are in them. So we're going to see what happens because what's sometimes what's on paper and what happens in reality sometimes um, isn't always the same, but you know, when you look at this, assuming there's no holes or there's no, you know, exploits or anything crazy like that, which I've been told that there isn't, um, then the self-sustaining feature should keep these things going quite a bit, right? Uh, but again, we'll see, we'll see. This one here is the self-sustaining one with ADA. Um, this one still has, what, $38,000 in the contract. Um, got me a nice chunk here that I can withdraw, but this one here is um, you know, when it first came out, it was paying out 10%. The USDT one is paying out 5%. This one here was paying out 10%. I don't believe it's paying 10% right now because that's how these things work, right? The algorithm, the percentage daily starts to decrease as the contract starts to decrease, but that's a good thing, right? It keeps this thing running a little bit longer. But yeah, whenever, whenever someone withdraws 25%, goes back in. So again, we'll see, you know, if these things, in fact, make it run longer than the other ones. Um, this is the cake one. This one still has uh, just under $80,000 worth of cake in the contract. This is the uh, sustainable auto compounding one, right? Um, this one here is BUSD Pirates. I did a video on this a couple of days ago. This one here is doing pretty well. Um, again, it's pretty steady, 17,856 BUSD in it. Um, nothing crazy, right? But again, as long as this thing is paying out, I'm good because all I can, all I got to do with these different miners is go around and, you know, either withdraw or collect. But I go around and see what see what they're doing, see how, see how much I have in my available balance, and then whether or not I want to withdraw or collect. And uh, you know, they're all paying out passively. So, um, yeah, they're doing their thing. Now, this one here, this is the original cake miner. You can see here, there's about eight hundred thousand dollars worth of cake in it. This one had a change of the link. So I've had a few of you guys messaging me saying, hey, the, the cake miner, I can't find it. So it used to be a DEX token. Um, it used to be a DEX token uh, URL. Um, it's a different um, It's a different URL right now. So I'll post it underneath this video, guys. It's the multichainminer.net one. So again, I will um, post that link down below. But this one here is still here. You can see I have 34 cake here uh, ready to withdraw or put back in we'll see but yeah this one here is you know it's not it's not dropping like a rock here yes there was a million dollars worth of cake at one point in this but again it's it's coming down steadily um but still eight hundred thousand dollars is still a lot of the cake and again considering that this one here is the original cake one and it's been running for a while you know that's a pretty you know pretty big testament to it this is the pulse cake one pulse cake this one here is still doing good 15.3 million pulse cake i can mine out of my available balance you can see here there's 1.2 billion dollars not imagine that dollars 1.2 million pulse cake in the contract here um so this one here again part of the multi-chain miner you know family right same developer so make sure you get the right link down below um, this is the original one, BNB miner, the original miner here. You can see here there's 4,660 BNB still on the contract. Uh, got me just under five at BNB here in my barrel. Um, but this one here, this is the one that's been running for, I, I don't know, I guess seven months now. Seven months now. So, I mean, this thing here has been running quite a while. So, those of you guys that got in very early with this or when we first originally started talking about it, um, you know, I'm assuming you guys are in total profit right now. But yeah, this one here is still doing its thing. Uh, Bitcoin. This is the Bitcoin miner. How much Bitcoin is there? 2.4 Bitcoin. Um, so yeah, the price of Bitcoin has been, you know, increasing. So this one here has been doing well. Uh, this is BUSD farm. Um, I'm not in too many of these 10% farms. This was the original, I think one of the original. No, actually Crypto Egg was the original 10% farm. This one here came out, um, you know, went pretty heavy into it. And yeah, you can see it's still paying. I got $1,254 with the BUSD. And there's still half a million BUSD. Again, at one point, there was a million 
BUSD in here. It's still over half a million BUSD, but again, it's it, it goes down very very slowly, guys. So um, yeah, this one here, you know, still pretty uh, so still pretty good, you know, running BUSD farm. This is the crypto egg one, seven hundred seventy one BNB, still in the contract. Got a BNB here that I can mine. Um, but yeah, this was the original 10% one. This one here has been running for a couple of months. And uh, to think that there's still 771 BNB, it's, uh, you know, it's pretty, uh, it's pretty solid. Um, this is the ADA miner, 320 ADA here in my balance. This one still has about 98,000 ADA in it. So pretty good. Um, XRP, 1,217 XRP in my balance. I have Actually, the contract has a little bit over 96,000 XRP still uh, in the contract. So, yeah, this one here is doing, doing well. A lot of you guys made tons of profit with this, especially if you got in, you know, at the very, very beginning when first launched. Same thing with ADA. The ADA miner, the, this XRP miner, a lot of you guys uh, made quite a bit of profit on this. So, congratulations to you guys. Uh, Shiba Inu uh 80,000 plus dollars worth of Shiba Inu still in the contract. Um so yeah, this one here is still doing its thing. Uh CNS got 191,000 CNS here. Yeah, there's 16 just under 17 million CNS in the contract still. So this one here uh part of the family that is uh the BTC one, the Rex one, the ADA one, the XRP for all from the same dev team. Um, yeah, that's what's going on there. Safe pal, this one here, 2,408 safe pal on the contract. Uh, this is the Rex miner right here. Uh, so this one just about to go over 2 billion Rex in the contract. Sounds like a lot of Rex, but the price of Rex is so <laughs> minuscule right now. Um, will it recover? Will it increase? We'll see. You know, people are just dumping the Rex in here because why? Why not? I mean, just you're just gonna have it sit in your wallet. You might as well have it in here and you know make three percent a day with it. Of course, you know value wise, it, it ain't much, but you know the goal here is to maybe stack as many of these Rex tokens as you can when they get ready for Rex 2.0. You know, we'll see what happens with the price of that. Uh, but yeah, so far, you know, 2.0 version isn't uh, set to launch. Does anybody know the date or the approximate time of when? The 2.0 version is going to launch. I don't. I think I missed it. I wasn't keeping up with it. Maybe some of you guys know. Some of you guys are in that Telegram way, way, way more than me. Um, let me know. Post it down below in the uh, in the comments, um, and whether or not you are going to be jumping into the 2.0 version. Some of you guys might, you know, feel like you've, you know, had your fill already with Rex, and you're moving on to another thing or the next thing. And God knows, there's so many different projects to get into. Some of you guys might be looking to jump into the Rex 2.0. I don't know. Let me know. I'd love to find out, you know, the temperature of the market and see how people are feeling about this um, this particular project here. But yeah, Rex 2.0 should be coming, you know, pretty soon. Um, this is the crypto miner. Let me see. Let me go to the cake. Creek, the, the cake, the cake infinity miner. A seven cake here. The balance, there's 11,382 cake in the balance. Um, so yeah, this one here is still doing its thing. Let me switch on over and check on the hex, which is on Matic. Okay. Let's go to hex. All right, so the hex miner still has 655,000 hex in it. Um, as far as the contract goes, so yeah, this one here doing its thing still. And then the other one on Matic that I'm in is the Ethereum one. This one still has about 19 and change, 19.29 ETH still in the contract. So this one's definitely, you know, has been decreasing. You know, we'll see what happens here. Um, but just wanted to give you a quick update on that. Last but not least for these miners is Tron. Tron miner still has 404,000 PRX in the contract. So um, yeah, this one here is still doing its thing. So that being said, guys, this one here was uh, you know sent to me a couple of days ago. Um, and again, I was traveling, so I took did take a quick look at it. It looked pretty interesting because I am 
you know, getting pretty heavy into NFTs. Um, but, you know, wanted to, uh, you know, actually do a video on it. I'll probably do a standalone video for this uh, as we get closer to the launch. The actual launch, launching of this is going to be, I believe, Thursday. Um, yeah, I think it's Thursday when this thing launches. I'm doing this video Monday, so maybe by the time you watch this video, it might have already launched. I don't know when you're going to see this video. But this one here is launching on, I believe, Thursday. Um, if you want to get more info, you know, just jump into their Telegram, follow them on Twitter. Um, October 28th. What is that? Is that Thursday? Yeah, that's Thursday. So Thursday, 9 p.m. UTC time. I don't know what the time that is in your time zone. you got to find out. But that's when the minting will go live. Again, if you want to stay up to date with that, you can check that out. Um, obviously follow them on telegram but yeah this is an interesting project if you're into nfts or even if you're not into nfts if you're into passive income because this one here um you'll be able to um you know earn bnb rewards um by having these nfts in your portfolio obviously the more more of these nfts that you have in your in your uh, portfolio the more rewards you're going to get so just wanted to put it on your radar um again i'll do a standalone video for it go into more detail but as you can see here it's pretty cool you know especially if you're into nfts um you know i've definitely seen you know nfts that have blown up that don't look this good <laughs> um this is a pretty you know pretty pretty good uh pretty good artwork let me go into here real quick and show you um give me one second here switch up switch back over to bnb Okay. So if you if you go on Pancake Swap, right? There's a couple of uh, things here you can check out under the NFT tab. You can see here that some of these NFTs right here. Um, you can buy some of these NFTs: two point three nine nine BNB, two point four BNB, two point four seven BNB. This is the Pancake Squad. Go to highest price. You got this one here, 10,000 BNB for this one. Uh, Pancake, Squ Pancake Squad number 9900. Look at that, it's $4.8 million worth of BNB is the asking price. Same with this one, 10,000 BNB, 10,000 BNB, 10,000 BNB. Um, you got a lot of these things that are you know going for 10,000 BNB, which is $4.8 million right now with the price of BNB. I'm not saying that this is going to go to that, um, but man, if it does a fraction of <laughs> what that one does, it's going to be happy days for a lot of you guys. Plus, unlike you know those NFTs on PancakeSwap, this one here, you get BNB rewards, right? Twenty percent reflection rewards to minters, five percent reflection rewards to the lottery pot. So again, I'll, I'll I'll do a standalone video for this. This is definitely an interesting project. Again, I just wanted to introduce it to you, put it on your radar because it is launching on Thursday. Um, of course, the more rare NFTs are gonna be worth more. Um, here's the roadmap. Again, I'll cover all this in my standalone video. But yeah, they have a couple things on their roadmap. 10,000 eight heroes are gonna be minted Thursday. Um, lottery is split between 10 random mint holders. And then a marketing campaign will launch with different BSC influencers, crypto YouTubers, et cetera, et cetera. So this one here, I think there's like 1,234, something like that, 1,200 plus people in their Telegram already. Um, so the community seems like it's growing. Um, yeah, so this can be very, very big. Of course, the more you put in, more NFTs you purchase uh, or mint, um, more rewards you're going to get. So Again, I'm not telling you what to do. I'm not telling you to, you know, ape into this thing, right? No pun intended. Um, you know, do what you want to do. You know, I just wanted to put it on your radar. Uh, but you can see here, there's a couple of tabs you can look at. Market, right? Once you uh, mint, you'll be able to look at your NFTs in here. And then those of you guys that are into passive income, you'll be able to see your rewards, minting rewards, marketplace rewards, et cetera, et cetera. So anyway... That being said, guys, lots of stuff going on, you know, between the uh, the Manor Farm launching pretty soon, 
Uh, we have pulse chain still in the background. We haven't talked about that. It's still probably a couple of months away, but that I'm super excited about and bullish on. Um, Hex has been doing really, really, really well. Now, eight heroes, right? NFTs that pay you being uh, BNB rewards is going to be on BSC, of course. Um, and then other NFTs, right? I'm, I'm getting into other NFTs uh, in, in another wallet. Um, I usually keep my NFTs in another wallet just to kind of spread things out because God forbid I get hacked and everything's in one wallet. That is not going to be a happy day for me. So, um, yeah, maybe a good idea to, you know, have different wallets, maybe a wallet for passive income platforms or another wallet for NFTs, um, another wallet for your stakes, because um, I have a lot of stakes that are going on as well. We'll talk about more of that um, in the future. So lots of really, really cool projects running and about to launch and coming down the road. So this is a great, great time to be in crypto, guys. Uh, but yeah, if you want to check this out, I'll leave a link for this down below. Uh, follow me on Telegram, guys. Again, if you haven't already, subscribe to this channel. Hit the little bell icon so you'll get notified straight away um, whenever I post a brand new video. And of course, as always, only put in what you can afford to lose. I'm definitely not giving you any type of financial advice, guys. So that being said, I'll catch you in the next video. Peace.